Hi, I'm David Dodge. Welcome to Green Energy Futures. As unlikely as this may seem, Alberta is in the midst of a solar boom. We came to that realization after we did a recent story on solar. Evan Wilson is with the Canadian Renewable Energy Association, and he's based in Calgary, Alberta. It wasn't long ago when Alberta had very little solar. When I started in the renewable sector, there were two megawatts of solar uh, connected in Alberta, and that was about 2016 or so. Today, uh, when it comes to behind the fence or rooftop solar, we've gone from two megawatts to 80 megawatts is what we have in place right now. For perspective, we're talking about 6,168 small solar systems, and these systems generate enough electricity to power about 20,000 homes. But that's only part of the solar story. Then you have big solar projects, those larger than 5 megawatts. So big solar is relatively new. Right now, we have 20 megawatts of large solar projects online in Alberta. In our development queue, there is about 5,000 additional megawatts of solar being developed in this province right now. This means we're in the eye of the solar storm. So far, Albertans have installed four times more capacity in small solar systems on their homes and businesses, those 6,168 small solar systems that we mentioned before. But as Wilson says, there's an incredible 5,000 megawatts of solar in the development queue today. Included in these projects are several of the largest solar projects in Canadian history. Some of these are really unprecedentedly big. Um, You have the Claire's Home Project, which is 130 megawatts, um, I I believe it is. And then, uh, and that's quite big. And then even from there, there's the Travers Project, which is 430 megawatts, um, which will will be the biggest project that we've seen um, in Canada. We visited the Claire's Home Solar Project late last year. It's nearly complete and consists of 477,000 solar modules. The Travers project, due to start construction near Vulcan, Alberta this year, is a half a billion dollar project that will consist of 1.5 million solar modules. It will produce enough electricity to power 100,000 homes. You know, there is really some massive investments being made in solar in Alberta. Um, because of the power of the solar resource here, because we have so many sunny days um, in Alberta. Wilson says Alberta's deregulated market is very attractive to solar developers who are eyeing three key sources of revenue. Selling to the grid, creating power purchase agreements, and carbon credits. Companies like Apple, Google, Facebook, and many others have purchased large amounts of renewable energy. This, too, is driving demand in Alberta. TELUS has made announcements uh, about buying power from the uh, the Rattlesnake Ridge wind farm. As well, uh, there was an announcement that RBC uh, is buying power from, uh, from, from solar plants that will be built by a partnership between Blue Earth Renewables and Bullfrog Power. The City of Edmonton, the federal government, and others are looking to purchase 100% renewable energy, which bodes well for Alberta's solar boom. Alberta solar expert Gordon Howell says if all of these solar projects were developed, Alberta would get more than 10% of its electricity from solar. While all of these projects in the queue will not likely be developed, more will replace them in the future. Learn more at greenenergyfutures.ca. For Green Energy Futures, I'm David Dodge.